Hey drummers, hope you're well. Shout out to superstar channel member Thomas who asked about this. This is Motherless Children, Eric Clapton. So this was played by Jamie Oldacre on the original and there's a great live version live in San Diego with Steve Jordan on drums. Uh, man, it's an amazing thing. Like, I'm going to break down this part and I'm going to, as usual, put the notation and a nice practice along version of like a little basic phrase on the channel members page. But you've got to listen to it and you've got to see it, man, because the feel of this thing is just its own thing, isn't it? I'm tempted to say it's a simple thing. Getting it to feel right, I think isn't, but at its heart, the idea is simple. So make no mistake, I'm not saying this is easy or simple, but I'm saying the concept is not sim is not complicated. It's a single stroke roll, right? The bass drum plays on the beat. So, so far, somewhat simple. Uh, on the, I don't think Jamie Oldacre is doing this necessarily all the way through, but on the Steve Jordan version, he's playing eighth notes on the hi-hat, which is really cool. And like bouncing along on the ball of his left foot, some good close-ups of his left foot. Uh, that's that. And then there's an accent pattern in it, and the accent pattern is somewhat changing, and it's uh, not one particular thing all the way through. Uh, what I've tried to do is, like I say, on the channel members page, I'll post this now, kind of like a two-bar phrase that kind of sums up what this is all about. Something like this. So the basic accent pattern is something like, one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four and a. So that's the one I'll put, like I say, on the notation and practice along um, on the for the channel members there. But man, give it a listen, give it a play along. It's yet another example of just how much mileage we can get out of one of the simplest concepts in playing the drums, which is a single stroke roll as sixteenth notes or whatever note value with accents in place and a bass drum pounding away. Yeah, the hi-hat here is cool as well, but man, it just brings the thing to life. Obviously in the tune, there's some pushes and that kind of stuff. I'll do a full playthrough of the tune actually shortly on this channel, just for fun. But um, I just thought it was a lovely thing to put out there. Again, all, all comes back to basics, doesn't it? Single stroke roll, grade one, page one. Bass drum on the beat. In this case, like I said, the Steve Jordan version anyway. Hi-hat with the left foot. Sense. 
So it's like a little bit train beat. I heard it referred to as a shuffle. It's not really a shuffle, is it? I get why people would say that, but it isn't really a shuffle. It's more like classic train beat. And uh, I love it, just to put it out there. So shout out to amazing channel member, Thomas. I'll do a full playthrough of that one for you shortly, Thomas, like I say, but that'll get you going with the main groove. Thanks for watching as always. Cheers.